this is going to be uh, a way for you to check your division problem since we didn't have time to do that today, short in time. Um, so you can pause it right here. This is the worksheet that was from Friday with synthetic division and polynomial division. A couple things to note, uh, like this minus, it could be up here as a plus a negative, that's fine. But if, pause it right here, check your answers. I'll show you the work here in a second. Uh, if you pause, then you can see if you get any wrong. If you get any wrong, then you can watch for the work. So here's the first section. Again, pause if you want to see, double check some things. There's five and six. This is the first part of division. The monomial denominator might have gotten you. We talked about the last minute there. You can just write it as straight division. You don't have to do polynomial division with that. You're just taking 9b. This is the kind of division you did before you got into this class. P plus 4. If we were doing this as a synthetic division, we could. That would be a negative 4 for your outside there. Friendly reminder that if you were giving a choice, you couldn't, 9 and 10, we would not use synthetic division. We did not learn that shortcut. Uh, some of you got stuck over here on this problem because when you multiply back, everything comes down. Just bring down the next two things. So nine went into 90 10 times. And so bring down the next two things before you subtract. And everything will go away just fine. So I brought both of those down. Just skips a power. Again, synthetic division. That says n squared minus 5n plus 5. The answer is going to be one power less than what your original value where you're dividing. Okay. Again, see what questions you have. We'll review all of our polynomial works together on next class.